And folks, we are back, and right now we are here at Disney's Animal Kingdom at Walt Disney World, Florida. I love this place so very much. I think it's one of my, uh, I think it is my favorite park, actually. I'm gonna say it, I will say it right here, right now. Animal Kingdom is my favorite park. I absolutely love Pandora. I think they did an amazing, absolutely beautiful job at making that uh, land of Pandora. It's beautiful during the day, it's beautiful at night. When the lights come on, oh my goodness, it's gorgeous. Anyway, so, we're here at Animal Kingdom. Let's go, follow along. It's the Tree of Life. Folks, there's over 300 carvings inside of that Tree of Life. You know, when you first come here during the summer, you think it's real. It looks real, but it is not. It is Disney magic. So Plotted Passage only has a 50 minute wait, which is an amazing ride, yet Mojave River has a 75. Yeah, it's, uh, it's beautiful, but it's not amazing like uh, Plotted Passage, in my opinion. Anyway, I think it's Plotted Passage time. Good, how are you? Good. Wow. This is my first time in here. So I've made it inside the Nomad Lounge and the first drink I'm gonna try here is the Lamu Libation. So Lamu Libation, as I read, has a Star African Rum, the Cruisin Banana Rum, Guava puree with orange, lime, and pineapple juices, and it's topped with Ghost Gonsling's 151 rum. Let's give it a taste. Look at it. Look how pretty that is. I don't do a lot of cocktails. I'm a beer drinker. So for me to have a cocktail is uh, a little, it's a change for me. So let's give this a taste. I want a beer. I don't like it. For this price, it's uh, fourteen dollars, and I like whiskey. I like rum. I like beer. I don't think I like this, but I'll finish it. I'm sure. If you like. Um, Maybe it just needs stirred up. You know what? I got a straw. Let's stir this up. Maybe that's what it's missing. Let's try this. And here at Disney World, you're gonna get the paper straws. So, don't, if you want your own straw uh, that's not paper, bring it with you. I got a lot of friends to do that. They bring their own straws with them, so that's a good thing to do. All right, let's stir this bad boy up. The presentation was there, it's pretty. Let's see, let me get all this flavor incorporated. Whatever was on top was not my favorite. I'm gonna ask them what was on top too. So much better. Oh, so much better. I could taste the pineapple there. Now, yeah, before I was all, I was nothing but the alcohol of whatever that last one was. So once I get a chance, I'm gonna ask them what it was. All right, so I asked and I was, I should have read it better. It read, it reads on there, it was topped with the 151. So that's what it was, 151. When I took a drink out of that, I was like, ooh, no, 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 no. I, I did not like the flavors. Makes sense now, it was 151. Of course it's gonna be strong. Let's do some lunch. 
even though I wanted the lobster mac and cheese, I've got dinner tonight with my family and I cannot have, I don't want a lot of food in me. So we'll try out this, uh, a couple of these beef sliders. We'll see how many comes with it, see how many I eat. I'm not a big fan of eating a, a lot of food during the day. So um, I think I've told you guys that before. So yeah, we'll have, uh, We'll have to see what is going on with this place and the decor. I like the decor a lot. Um, I don't know how uh, people are doing the tags up top here. I don't know if they're still available or not, if you can still do them. That's what's running through my mind is, is it something everyone does? Is it something that you had to purchase to get your, you know, I don't know. It's like leaving a dollar bill at a dive bar. You know, you can write your stuff on there, leave it and tack it up there. We like doing that. We've done that a few places. So, yeah. It's a cool little lounge here at Disney's World Animal Kingdom. I like it. You go right now. All right, so for $16 here, you are getting yucca fries and two sliders. Let's take a look inside this slider. A little bit of a beef. All right, so I just got this, the yucca fries. I'm gonna taste it without the ketchup. Taste them on Yeah. I like those a lot. I do like those. Very thick, very, very uh, filling. Lots of. I would say it's really good. All right, I'm gonna try it. I'm dunking in ketchup. I kind of like them without the ketchup. Better. The ketchup masks the flavor how good these are. Well, yeah. no ketchup. But it does need something wet. Malt vinegar, maybe? Maybe malt vinegar? I don't know. All right, so somebody just heard me. One of the guys members that works here, uh, bartenders, heard me say it needs something different other than the ketchup, so he brought me a, I don't know, Chipotle something? It's, it's I don't want to spill it, but uh, it's like a, a little bit of a, Mayonnaise based something. There it goes. There it is. Yep. Yep. That keeps the flavor of the yucca fries and it adds the flavor of um, whatever that sauce is. Completely different than just regular ketchup. That did it right there. I was just saying it keeps the flavor of the yucca fries. The ketchup. The ketchup doesn't, it masks the flavor of this. Thank you. Yeah. That'll work right there. All right, let's try this slider. All right, these are really small sliders. They're, I don't know how the, there it is, that's working better. But, they look really juicy. Mm. It's dripping down my thumb. Mm. Mm -hmm. You know, I love salt when on my food. I don't know why. I don't know what brought me to do that, but there's no salt needed. It's really, really, really tasty. So. Come on. This is the Nomad Lounge. It's right beside Tiffin's, inside of Animal Kingdom. Uh, and I asked if there's walk-ins. They said, yep. 45-minute uh, wait. I said, let's do it. So I got a text message saying, we're ready. I'm here. I'm ready. I'm having a good time. Getting a little bit of lunch. I'm glad it's not a lot of food. Because I'm gonna go ride some rides, go enjoy myself, go walk around a little bit, and then I got plans tonight. So thanks for joining. Folks, the decor in here is like I said, it's pretty awesome. It's um I don't know I don't know what 
made it made them want to do this look. I hear it's only been up about three years or so. So I like it. So if you like this video and others like it, make sure you hit the subscription button right below. Make sure you hit that bell as well to catch the notifications that are coming up on our next videos. Alright, we'll see you there.